We spend a lot of time demonstrating that uh, price embedded barcodes such as this one work on Clover machines, but as it turns out, we've never showed demonstrated it on a Clover Flex. And so in this video, we're going to demonstrate how it's possible to utilize these kind of barcodes with the Clover Flex. So to get started, we're going to use an app called Variable Price Barcode Parser. And we were going to make sure that this configuration here is complete. Now, to have this completed, we're going to close the app and look for settings. Um, and in settings, we'll navigate all the way down to accessibility. And in accessibility, we'll find uh, variable price barcode parser in the off position. And we'll need to turn it on. Uh, turning it on will require us to uh, OK it, confirm it, and sometimes enter the passcode. Um, so once we've done that, and if we navigate back to this app, we'll see that the configuration is now complete and the app is ready for use. So the next thing is to configure this barcode that we have in our inventory app. And so we're going to open our inventory app. And first we're going to check if we already have this item set up or item with the same product code. So here is the barcode, right? So we're gonna look for 200400. And we will search for that here, 200400. And we get no results. So we need to set up this item. And we're going to give it a same name. So we call it a wedge. And we're going to change fixed pricing to variable, like that. And then we're going to navigate to the product code field and enter 200400. That will be our product code. And then we can save this item. So there it is. Uh, it's a wedge. 200400 is a product code. And now we have this item. Here it is. And the total is uh, 2052. So I'm going to go ahead and close my uh, inventory app and just open the register app. Here it is, and I believe it's this black uh, button here that enables the barcode scanning camera, so I'm going to try it. Indeed it is, so this is what happens when I uh, press it. So I'm going to press this button and point my clover uh, to this barcode here, and it will scan it, and it scanned it. Let's just see what it did here. Okay. So uh, the wedge is 2052, which matches the label. There it is. Uh, and that's a uh, variable price barcode parser on a flex. Thanks.